How's it going, folks? Welcome back to the channel. Keith here from Commander Hoop Celtic. So, 6 0 win tonight in our first qualifier into Europe. Wasn't bad result. Six goals at home against a semi pro team from Iceland. Two from Mohamed Anusi, Julian scoring, Taylor scoring, Otten Edward scoring, and then an own goal as well. So, overall, wasn't bad at all. Um, made a couple of changes. Obviously, Alhamid coming in. Beaton coming into the squad, the boat lads looked composed at the back, no pressure for them at all. Couple of stages, but no panicky moments overall in the game. Barkas got a clean sheet, he had to make one or two saves, which wasn't bad for him. You know, like it just felt weird watching tonight. There were spells in the game where I felt bored watching it. I'm going to be brutally honest. It's just down to not having the fans. It just, just kills it. No atmosphere, no singing. You know, as much as Celtic can put a show on, score these amazing goals. Football's nothing without the fans, as they say. Definitely. I thought Mohamed Anousi was the player of the game, man the match. I just thought tracking out of him, the willingness to look for the ball, the willingness to get stuck into tackles, avoiding assists, scoring as well. He had the he had the package tonight. He looked really effective coming in from the wing as well. Obviously, the um, ball over the top as well from Julian was pretty good to get to, for Mohamed to score the first goal. Then, obviously, the second goal from Reykjavik on goal, which looked like it was Edwards. There was a spell that the ball was cleared off the line. It looked like a handball, but there wasn't that much of a, an appeal because it wasn't there. We were comfortably up as well. Julian scoring the header as well. Taylor scoring literally after the kickoff, the second half. With a header, congratulations, Greg Taylor. I thought he was going to come off during the game because he looked like he did have an in, an ankle injury, but he battled on, played quite well today. You know, really did play quite well. It's good to see Patrick Kamala and Abin Ajayi coming on as well in the seventy minute before Edward scored the goal. It was an absolutely brilliant finish by Edward, cracking finish. But overall, like it was more of a, it felt like more of a training game. It didn't feel like. There was literally nothing on the line tonight. It was that laid back. No atmosphere, as he said. Celtic were comfortable on the ball. They didn't really cause a threat to us. We can move on to next Tuesday. Hopefully, we'll find out tomorrow, which we will. It's either going to be the Swedish team or it's going to be the Hungarian team. So, we'll have to see what they can bring. But it'll be an extra level up than what we played tonight. And I wish Reykjavik all the very best in the Europa League qualification. But... Let's focus on Saturday. We have a game in hand on Saturday where we need to get this together. Well, two games in hand on Saturday to get this together. Obviously, Dundee United. Bruni came off for Olivier. Olivier played quite effective. Obviously, giving the ball into Anusi for the last goal. It was good to see a couple of players get on, get the legs stretched, getting the football rhythm of things, which is pretty good. So, that's my really opinion of the game. But there's not much to talk about. Six goals, clean sheet. Comfortable at home, no fans, that's really it. So roll on the next round. Speeches all soon. Comment below what you think of the game and hell hell.